Billy the Bully. One day, Billy was being naughty today and not doing as he was told. Just then, there was Oliver pulling some slate trucks from, Mount, from Blue Mountain Quarry. Billy puffed in and bit Oliver off the rails. And the slate was everywhere. Billy puffed away. I never even liked it, said Oliver sadly. Later, Paxton was about to go home. And then Billy raced in and cut through Paxton's line. Out of the way, square face, laughed Billy and puffed away. Paxton was sad and fed up. Billy was was being such a bully on Soldor today. Just then, Boko bustled in. Hi Paxton, he said. I heard that uh, Billy called you square face, he said. And it's not very nice, said Paxton. Anyway, let's go back to the sheds before Billy bullies us again. Sure, said Boko, and with that the two diesels were off. They were going back to the sheds before they get bullied by Billy. When they got to the sheds, Scarlowy and Rusty were already there. They were both arguing with Billy about the wooden about the wooden shed. It's too small, said Billy. I want something else to sleep with for the night, he said. I know, I'll sleep somewhere else. And it and it won't be a big deal to me, he said. You dummies think you're clever than me and smart as me? Well, I'll show you all. And with that, Billy was off. Boko was cross. I've had enough of Billy's attitude. Me too, said Paxton. He's, e he's even been, been mean to us this week. He has, said Scarlowy. I've got a big plan, said Boko. And with that, Boko whispered it to the three engines, and they all agreed. Later that day, Billy took some coaches to Wellsworth Station. Billy couldn't keep... Billy couldn't keep on waiting any longer. He couldn't cope with waiting. Just then, he biffed the coaches off the rails. Oh, 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 they screamed. What a horrid engine. Hayley was derailed and another... and another coach was derailed too. His driver was very cross. I'm very disappointed in you, Billy, he said. Look what you've done to the coaches. You know coaches don't like to be bumped. Billy was very cross. Just then he didn't realise Boko was behind him. Now that the coaches were derailed and Boko was behind Billy, there was no escape for Billy. You're not getting away, Billy, said Boko. Uh-oh, said Billy. Billy knew that voice. It's Boko. Billy couldn't stop. He crashed into the derailed coaches. The poor... The, the poor rad coach had no windows anymore. Billy smashed them, but smashed them on purpose. The fat controller was very cross. You have caused confusion and delay, he said. Yes, sir, I'm sorry, sir, said Billy. You will pull trucks for the rest of the day. I hope this will teach you a lesson not to bump coaches again. What? thought Billy. And with that, Billy puffed away crossly. And Boko was happy to be happy again, and, Bull, uh, and Billy 
will never bully all engines again.